Hey y'all, Farmer Dre back at it. I'm gonna show you guys real quick our greenhouse. We uh, go in and put on the plastic on it this past week. We got the end walls on the other side now. This week we're gonna go ahead and put the curtains on, get everything working on, get our wood stove in. We're gonna go ahead and buy a, a wood stove that has a thermostat on it so whenever it kicks off, it goes ahead and starts running. And uh, it's nice and toasty in here, even though the sides aren't on. The heat's get trapped. The heat gets heat gets trapped in here, and, uh, and it's probably about 15 degrees warmer in here than than outside. So that's a good news for us. Whenever the sun comes out, this heats up right away. And once the sides come on, then we're gonna go ahead and move our tomatoes into four-inch pots, put them in here, get them ready to go. And about the middle of February, move them inside our big high tunnel. Go ahead and plant them out there. We got about 370 tomato plants to go ahead and start it, and uh, go ahead and do that. And we'll get the job done. So these are the first tomato plants here on the farm. We have uh, 348 tomato plants. There's a three uh, 128 cell trays. I transplanted these the first week of, or I started the seeds rather, the first week of December. It is currently the second week of January right now. As you can tell, they're doing pretty good. They've got their first true leaves on. Then their second true leaves coming on the cotton. These things came out nice. I need to transplant them in the bigger pots and move them inside the greenhouse, the one we've been working on. So uh, that's that. But so far they're doing good. I got these fancy grow lights with the nice heat mat. We got a small spacer down there. This is a, the utility utility closet here in our store here. Let me turn off the lights here. There you go. See, and they're starting to turn a little yellow. They've been a little root bound, so that's why I need to move them out into bigger pots. We're gonna move them to four inch pots. So I should probably fertilize these with some nitrogen or some triple 13. But I'm going to go ahead this week and move them to a bigger pots so they could be growing. I don't like to see them this yellow, but that's just nitrogen deficient, deficiency on the leaves there, as you can tell. Just lack of nitrogen, but they're starting to get root bound a little there. There's itty bitty cells here, so 128 cell count trays. Well, that's that. So hopefully about the first of May, we'll be picking our first tomato crop off these the first crop that comes off them so we're hoping everything works out great that we get the heater and the greenhouse up and going